Hello everyone, this is Free and we are back. They are starting episode 11. We must stop the Paladin. And let's get started. Has planned at the Dark Lord. News about the elusive Paladin are dampening the morale of my subordinates and adding to my headaches. It's high time to deal with this shade fanatic once and for all. Let's get started. My lord, today we have again discovered traces of light magic in the manor corridors. I can't imagine how that vow Paladin managed to hide for so long. He's dangerous. Shall we advise a plan to catch him? Okay, bud, just find him already. <laughs> Our loyal warriors are eager for battle. Let's double the guards and capture the Paladin. The cadavers applied in joy. They will hide in the shadows and wait for the paladin to pass by. You need to decide whose plan to follow. Alright, let's be practical. We shall double the guards. One of the traders said these seeds would grow a crop of golden coins. Will you order them planted? Uh, go ahead and plant them. It's a good way to get money. A portal to the demon world has opened in the crypt. They could be useful allies. Hmm, make a deal with them. Yeah, just, just make a deal. I have a new item during the daily artifact inventory. Uh, let's examine it. Unfortunately, we couldn't wait for the paladin to appear. We need another plan. Uh, any ideas? Hellhounds can track the paladins by scent. We just need to find his personal item. How can we do that? Yeah. Are you a wizard or not? The alchemist has learned to turn air into gold. This will collapse the entire economy. Uh, better go ahead and stop him. On the night of the full moon, a meeting of spirits discussing urgent problems takes place in the cemetery. Uh, they're free to do as they please or listen. Uh, I think we should just listen, see if we can learn anything. The spirits of ancestors have made contact with zombies and skeletons. Now they help each other. Hmm, I say let's go ahead and encourage this. That way we can lower some of this wealth because it's getting a little bit too high. It wasn't easy. But our spies located his hooded quarters in the Order Kingdom. From there, they brought back several boxes of parchment. Okay, what is in them? I have to know. These are debt receipts, divorce records, and tax documents. All stamped with the seal of light. A week of light magic. All right, we will send out the hounds. Send out the hounds. The competition for the best beard among the visitors was won, as expected, by two lovely dwarf ladies. All right. Learn the secret of the beard styling. It can stabilize magic or 
more contestants. I think we need about a few more contestants. Just a few. One of the adepts splash holy water in my face. It's an assassination attempt. I say we will search for the traitor. I can't work during the day. I need a crypt for my experiments. But all the crypts in the manor are occupied by vampires. Build a new one. Yes, let's build a new one. The hounds corner the paladin. But he surrounds himself with a shield of light magic. We can't penetrate. It's magic. Or blackmail him. I will prepare a spell. The treasurer is stealing my ingredients and selling them back on the black market. Do something about it. Uh, let's let's. It's outrageous. Or we could get a little bit of money. Uh, I need a little bit of money right now. So yeah, let's get a little bit more cash. The magicians manage to create a ritual that instantly heals your warriors after battle. Exactly what do we need? It stabilizes wealth. About time. Uh, we need to stabilize my might. Yes. About time. Soldiers got poisoned. With some strange toxin while raiding village granaries. It's our enemy's plot. We can hire new ones. We can cure them. Uh, let's hire new ones. The spell broke the holy shield. But infected significant damage to the hounds. Uh, seize him. I accept defeat, but by the gods, I beg you to leave these papers. Leave them. Take them with the paladin. Yeah, I'm taking all of you, okay? Wise decision. Knowledge is always useful. The paladin's eyes were too plaintive, and you didn't burn his papers. Let's go to the manor. Yes, what do you say for yourself, Mr. Palatin? We are close to victory. The kingdom of water has almost surrendered to you. Soon the king of order will fall by your hand. Then the first step towards building the Dark Lord's Empire will be taken. The general heroically looks into the distance, putting his hand on his hilt of his sword. He looks as if he stepped off the pages of those books that write about great commanders. I say, prepare for battle. Hey, what do we have? Let's go to the bank. Do we ha no, you don't have anything to say. Okay, fine. What about you, H Tower? You don't have anything. So, the only one left that looks like we will go to the crypt. You don't have anything. What about the graveyard? Yes, memories about life. What do you say? You see the banshee flying over the cemetery, peering into each tombstone, and you decide to find out what she is searching for. Perhaps seeing a familiar name, I could recall something from the time when I was alive. Do you really remember nothing at all? Oh, of course I remember. But spirits only remember the most important things. Like who killed him to seek revenge. 
Someone killed you, just say the word and we'll gather an army to deal with them. For the first time you hear the bench, you laugh. It sounds eerie, but for some reason you like it. I'm flattered you are so quick to resort to murder, my lord. But I don't know the name or face of my killer. I think they were too clever and made it look like an accident. You remember anything else? I know I was born into a noble family and I had a family, a husband and two beautiful children. The elder daughter was as beautiful as the son and the son was extemporately intelligent for his age. I need to find my kin and help them so that we can find peace. When that happens, you will leave me. Oh no, my lord, you need not worry. The oath that to serve you is eternal, as am I. I curtly, you don't want to show her internal service pleases you. That's gone. Uh, let's see with the merchant shop. Titan increases might. First fear. The latest development of the swamp, which uses fear. I might need another one of those. Let me get that. Cold to the touch. With several moves, none of your choices will upset the balance. Oh, uh, yeah, I will get that one. It's a little expensive, but a frost amulet sounds like a good thing. And I will go ahead and leave you. And now I'll go visit the tavern and find out what is going on. The dragon kidnapped is waiting for me. Let's see. You find the alchemist brewing another potion. He is stirring something in a cauldron, humming an off tune tune. Oh, Dark Lord, it's good to see you. How's work progressing? I've added a new ingredient to the potion that we eventually become the perfect love potion. It will not only make the princess fall in love with me, but also make me look like a prince myself. The princess? The princess is the daughter of the king of water. She as beautiful as the dawn. The king of water voluntarily gave her to the dragon in exchange for the dragon not attacking his lands. Now the poor girl lives in a lonely tower on the kingdom's border. No knight has been able to defeat the dragon. But you, great dark lord, of course, will be able to. By that time, my great love potion will be ready. I can do everything. Yes, that will be okay. And looks like everything is fine, except I did not eat the kitty. Hello, kitty. Uh, what is this? Oh, this is for you. And I will upgrade you. Yes, I have done that. I will not neglect you. How about the bank? You're at eight. What about the mage at eight? Let me just go ahead and do nine. No, oh, that's six, that's seven. Okay, that's fine. I got seven with you. X. Make 
raise you. Age, did I ever raise you? Yes, I got you to seven. What about bank? Bank, I'll raise you. And how about the tavern? I will raise you. And looks like I have done everything for everyone. And let's go back to the story. And looks like everything has been wrapped up. That was a nice, quick adventure. So we're going on to the next one. I thank everyone for watching. And once again, have a wonderful night.